What's up, guys? Uh, welcome to TV. This is our interactive podcast, basically. We kind of discuss our opinions about games, content creation, informative topics. Um, this week is just going to kind of be like one of our chill hangout podcasts. We did have an interview lined up. Minute, so we kind of fell through at the last up. minute. Uh, the guy, the guy just was in here, and then he just didn't just disappeared <laughs> for like an hour. And we just we, we like spam added him inside the Discord. We're like, oh, where you at? Yeah. Hold on, and then oh, so, this is true. That's that's lovely. Um, but uh, more specifically, uh, we're going to be talking about some things that we see on social. This will not be in an interview. If you thought this was an interview podcast, you better get the fuck out because it's. <laughs> it's not what we said. This is an opinion pod. And we're coming in hot right now. So to start us off, we're going to be kind of talking about what is huge gaming conversation. Mike, you want to kind of just uh, explain like what's going on right now? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, there's a, there's a bunch of huge. But like, I think the main one by far, like everyone saw, at least everyone's meme. It's just a giant joke. The World Health Organization. They really are. They really are memeing it. It's kind of crazy. It, no, it's it's literally anybody that's in the gaming industry has at least said one thing about it. I had a tweet about it. I was like, I was like, next up, are mathematicians addicted to math? <laughs> Find out at seven. It's like, it was, that's it, what it, it seems like it, because it, it, like you're trying it, to like. Okay, I, I, let me just say this. Yeah, for well, this first of my... all, first of all, first of all, before anybody like for anybody okay. that doesn't know the game. World Health Organization classified gaming as like a, a mental health, health, like a mental health, which like it's huge because that mental means people can hard. like um, use their health insurance uh, for saying that they're addicted to video games, like things with their job. They can say that they have a problem with game addiction, playing like twenty hours a day, 20, 20 hours a week. And deeper than that, to, to be honest, like okay, so like let me just come on and say this. Like, do I definitely think that you can? Of course, like there are video games out there that League like, of Legends really grab you. I mean, <laughs> League of Legends. League of Legends. <laughs> I mean, League of Legends, but even even Fortnite, PUBG, like those. World of like, Warcraft. Even, yeah, but I mean, like World of Warcraft for sure. Um, I think that was like I the say, original. Game. Yeah. yeah. No, absolutely. There's still there's people who are still like. Um, but I think that uh, I think like games like Fortnite and PUBG really grab people because of the. Like, because you're trying to win. You're trying to be that last person standing. You get so, 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 so close, and then all of a sudden you just get, like, taken away. It's almost like gambling. Like, I've seen a lot of people, like, compare Fortnite and, like, Battle Royale to, like, gambling because you're getting so close, and then all of a you lose. And you start over because you got so, so much closer. But when it comes to, like, <clears throat> when it comes to people saying that, like, games, like, violent games make a violent person, I honestly don't think that's, I think that's a bullshit see- argument. The um, it was like uh, Good Morning America, I think it was in like Australia. They had some like psychologist or scientist or whatever that was just spitting out. Yeah, I uh, retweeted it. Lucid, I retweeted lucid, it with a comment. Right. Um, yeah, like lucid facts. Yeah, dude. <laughs> he does look like a. Tomato. I got a sunburn. Okay. That's so sun, dude. He literally is an actual. T- <laughs> it looks like somebody turned up your contrast on you. All right, I'm gonna back up. I'm gonna back. Wait, I'm gonna get back here. Look like you actually look like that gift that Mike always. It's the oh, bomb, the, tomato. the tomato. All right, I'm back here. Oh, Fuck you guys. I <laughs> love that gift, dude. That Loki, that's the funniest gift. Like, don't even ask. It me. works for that's everything. The funniest gift, dude. It works for literally. I just send it to people just to fuck with them. I just, I just go with it. I love that. Gift. But me and yeah. me and Eric just. I spam it. I just, oh my gosh, dude. I'm I, I I'm pulling it up. <laughs> as we speak <laughs> but uh so on the topic of gaming just um yeah i definitely i i i understand where they're coming from <laughs> it is the funniest gift ever he's like, he's like what uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it could be used for a lot of stuff but anyways the, what you're saying nico um i just like i, I understand where they're coming from because you got me in the caretaker spot, by the way, or at least you have my name as caretaker. All right, everybody just shit I, on uh, Eric. <laughs> also, and put that picture where. No, that's not happening. <laughs> stop, stop interrupting. Nico, go ahead. All right. Finally, uh, 
I just think that, uh, like, I, I understand where they're coming from because I've been addicted. To, like, RuneScape was the first game that I was, like, heavily addicted. Just, like, Same. come home and just play, like, straight, like, five, six hours of RuneScape. Same. Next game that I got addicted to is probably League. And then my most recent addiction was Overwatch, dude. I can't, I can't. Time I put into Overwatch. Even PUBG, dude. I feel like, so, just, like, let this sink in first. Like, League of Legends. I looked it up. I have about 800 hours. Nothing. That is only including... I've been playing League of Legends for about four years. So it's really... It's like 200 hours, like, a year. Really not that bad. Now, I've had PUBG for one year. Three. Almost 400 hours. A lot. That is a shit ton. I had 32, day, I had 32 days on Modern Warfare 2. Yo, uh... My... Uh, you might have a lot of hours on that, but that doesn't even. Dude, you have no idea how much yeah. time Mike right, has put Nico, on that so, game. So listen to this, Nico. I have, His Smurf I have, account has probably tripled have, your games played have, on your main. On my on my main account, on my first account that I ever had, I have twelve thousand normal games. Yeah, that's yeah, so about, that's, that's about, tw- that's, that's, about that's, that's just normal games. Not to mention ranked games across three accounts. Yeah, from when I started playing ranked, it's it's. It's a lot. I mean, yeah, ooh, you gotta, that's I mean, you a gotta, lot. You got to assume. I mean, I like to average out about forty-five minutes. Right. I feel like I feel like in no, lower, not twelve thousand hours. Not, it's not. If you average out the game to be five minutes, about just it's five hundred and forty. Five hundred and forty thousand hours. No, what are you doing? Uh, you just wait, multiplied, wait. Mike. I multiply. I multiplied. My bad. Duh. You know how to do math, math bro? Nope. What the hell? I thought you were, I thought you were older than me. <laughs> you said five hundred and forty thousand hours. <laughs> that's that's a lifetime. That's actually five hundred. That's over a hundred years. <laughs> we, had a, we had a spontaneous marina appearing. Appearance in the a wild Bigfoot okay. appeared. Yeah, it just walked across the bed. Yeah, no, that's actually it. way too much. Yeah, it's it's 266 <laughs> hours of just it's 266 uh, hours of um of what's it called? Uh, Gameplay. Play. Jesus, I think. I, I don't no think way. I'm doing that. Right. No, I don't think I'm doing no that. Right. No, it's, you're I, probably. At, I'm you're probably still at doing at it wrong. Like tw- you're probably at about like I would say you're about 1,200 maybe. 30. No, easily. Easily. Twelve thousand games, that's at least that's at least six thousand hours. Tried, that's at least six thousand hours. Be try and fail at math. Dude, literally, like you thirty minutes, twelve thousand games. It's not it's not that it's not that hard to figure out. Moving on. Moving on. A little bit over six thousand hours. Moving on. We Stop trying to do math. Now. We need to figure this out now. <laughs> but uh so yeah, so I don't know. i like I understand. It makes sense. But like, I think it's kind of a bullshit. Thing. You're just giving people excuse, like, just stay home. Yeah, with like a mental disorder, like actually... yeah, because like everything has to have a title. But then, okay, time out. Then if oh, dude, we're about to get into conspiracy theory. Boom, boom, boom. All right, <laughs> so listen. So now that now that it's a mental disorder, you are now probably legally allowed to get medicine for this. Medicine. Oh, jeez. Right, yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. That's what I was saying about the insurance. Right. So then, like, so then, what are they going to be prescribing them? Next, they're going to be prescribing them this, like, and now you're going to have more people addicted. To- you have more people, like, mm. what do they give people for like depression? Then it is a conspiracy. I don't know. Yeah. Right. Right. I don't know. What's a normal <clears throat> Mike, you, Mike, get- you brought up the. Mike, you brought up that example of where you said that people could just claim that on their insurance. Insurance doesn't have to offer anything that supports that. Oh, no, but, like, if they go to, like, something that is... Yeah, I'll look it up. Prozac. Is it Prozac for depression? Yeah, it is Prozac. He's had depressants. It would probably be Prozac. Adderall. Ad- I, w- I was going to say Adderall, yeah. Make them play even more games. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, by the way, Tweety, uh, caretaker's away for uh, personal problems. Or personal, yeah, just a personal thing. Just He's not going to be here this week. Probably, he might not, uh, but... He, he died. Back. He died. Yeah, he died. <laughs> we just don't want to talk about it. He gone. 
I just jumped in, fill me in. That's what he's got you on. Um, so, so essentially, I'll fill, you, I'll fill you in. So essentially, we had a interview lined up, and literally he just didn't answer us. So we had to go. We had a, we had a plan B. We had a plan B. So it wasn't like t- terrible. But it, our plan. This is our plan B. Is talking but, about like um, gaming world World Health Organization's ruling on um, gaming disorders and. And also, we wanted to talk a little yeah, bit about the social media aspect too. Hey, hey winging it. Yep, that's it. <laughs> No, Sweet we got it. Actually, no, yeah, we had a point. He is actually right. Actually, yeah, uh, Adderall is a common drug use. For- is it really? Really? Yeah, because you got to think it's like an it's an upper. So you're counteracting the down that you're already feeling. Depression. So drug. Back up, yeah, because like it's that. probably from like productive. Like, yeah, you because you're because usually when you're depressed, you like want to sleep. Like don't want to like do anything. True. You just, like kind of want to be like there. So like if you take Adderall, it becomes it makes you more more productive. Yeah, there's like there's a couple of things on here that I'm uh like familiar with, like because I've heard of them, like Vicodin, Prozac, uh, Xanax, Zoloft. Like, there's a ton of like I've heard Zoloft like, uh, um advertised on. Uh, that's another thing is like when you hear when you see, I was gonna be a pharmacist, so like I could go pretty deep on all this stuff. But like they show these commercials and then they play this psychology game on you where they show like all these people being all happy and everything. And then they, they quickly read off, this may cause suicide. This may cause this. This may cause your liver to fail. This may cause your heart to fail. And then yeah. everybody's like smiling, playing with their kids on the wagon. But, okay, I couldn't believe okay. you were going to be in uh, pharmacy. Dude. Like that's like actually the most like that's, messed that's up. The most, yeah, that's like, no. the most scummy job that you could go for, I think. Now what I have to say about that though is <clears throat> like... The whole like in side US. effect thing is like so. I'm on allergy medicine right now. I go in every week to get like the biggest dosage of allergy medicine. And like, there is like a side effect that you can be put into like it. Like, they would be like the same thing as if I ate a peanut. Like, basically, yeah. my throat would start to close and everything like that. You'd have to use an EpiPen. Now, the chances of that happening is like one in five hundred thousand people. But because one person has had that, they have to, they have to say it. Right. The only problem with that is, is I don't think people realize like how powerful their mind is. So like if you automatically start to think like, oh, this medicine might make me start having suicidal thoughts, like the chances of you having those suicidal <laughs> suicidal <laughs> thoughts. Yeah, the chances- we have a fourth yeah. guest. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, we kind of have another one. We have Adam back there too. Oh yeah, <laughs> they, can't, they can't see him. They can't see him. <laughs> but uh. Oh, it's okay, but uh, yeah, so like, you know, you, you automatically start thinking like this, then all of a sudden that like, I don't know, like, it, I feel like it great, greatly increases the chance of those side effects. I don't know, I just think, I, I'm, ex- I shouldn't say I'm excited, but I'm interested to see how this whole, whole thing, like, like, how, like what is really going to come actually. I think it'll be like net neutrality, it'll just blow over and nobody, everyone else will forget about it. Yeah, that's crazy, by the way. People that had, didn't really talk about that. Oh, which Dude, was it was really crazy. blowing up on Reddit actually. Like it, a ton of people were talking about. It. it was it was probably like blowing up for like a day on Twitter. Weird because the gaming disorder thing has been going on like all week. Like I've been seeing memes about it. I've been seeing people talk about it. But like the net neutrality thing, the fact that like they just got rid of it and then they were like, "Oh yeah, this sucks," and then just stopped talking about it. Like that's insane. Yo, speaking of that's like amazing. speaking of drug side effects, I was watching. I don't know if I was watching. Yeah, I was watching a YouTube video today. I don't know how I got on it. I think it was on my recommended. And it was talking about how um, this this kid that didn't speak English, him and his mom came over from like some other country, didn't speak English. This kid loved gummy candy, and his mom thought that the gummy bear vitamins were gummy candy. So he ate, oh, no. he ate an entire bottle of gummy vitamins. And his, like, oh, he went into a coma. His stomach, like, ex- like this big, like off of his... Yeah, it was, it was crazy. But... The like the core point. Uh, I've of, always wondered. I've honestly, I've honestly always. The the core point of what I'm trying to say is is that um they got into this thing about uh vitamin A, which is like essentially what me and Marina took was with the uh um what, what's the oh, for Accutane? yeah for Accutane that's like a huge dose of vitamin A and it was saying yeah. they were saying like the long term side effects of that were like had a bunch of bone density issues and like I was I was mm-hmm. just like whoa I took that and I'm supposed to take it again but I'm not after re- watching all the side effects and reading all that stuff. Wait, hang on. Uh, Bob Lab Law's blog. Parker, okay. That's you. Yeah. All right. What do you mean my drugs are heavily tested before going to... Talk about, like, side effects-wise? Or, like, like saying, like... like Osteoporosis, Osteoporosis for the win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, there's so many. I just, I just see so many things in pharmacy and like any type it's of pill that just like there's so many side effects. They basically could sell all the drugs that are helpful to people at cost, and they yeah. don't. Yeah, they like just, like that. Be pen. The, the, I think okay, I Nico started, man. One company, it's like I, there's this one company that there's this disease that people have, uh, eight thousand people in the United States have, and they made a pill for it that that like basically when they sleep, their body destroys all their red blood cells. Dude, so it, yeah, so it don't even up. get me don't even get me started on how yeah. fucked up pharmaceutical companies dude. dude and so they like, eight thousand people yo listen yeah, eight thousand people crazy. have this and then they could charge it they could fucking like basically give this pill to people six hundred thousand dollars insurance companies i know it's so crazy dude like okay That's me and jordan were, me and jordan were talking about this when we were uh we were up at you know up in uh up north I'm not gonna give any specific in, direction in the TVB cabin yeah. but uh basically um we were talking about like you know like how many overdoses on like heroin like right they just get narcane and it's like completely like free like blah 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 give it to them here you go you know bring them back to life slap on the wrist have a nice day they can't even get epipens because of how expensive they are like something that could easily like just cure somebody's like whole life just by just from like something like that like just from like ingesting a peanut for instance but an ambulance can't have it so they depend so they like put it on you to like always carry your epipen you don't have your epipen on you or you forget it like there's nothing they can really do like the the next step would be they have to cut open your throat and like insert a tube to like get air basically they could get you like an iv it's really fucked up dude. yeah and, like, it, the it, amount of money that you have to spend on epipens is ridiculous dude it's so creepy yeah uh, parker just said how they marked up the pill for eight by a thousand percent. So I, yeah, I keep hearing that we're about guy, to get a cure for cancer. Does anybody know anything about that? Yeah, it's called marijuana. Other than that. <laughs> um, yeah, Other they, than like, weed. They, uh, they yeah, found, weed. They, tested, they tested on rats with tumors. And I guess like 85% of the rats tested lost their tumors completely vanished. Hmm. A good thing we're rats. I think we're... Yeah exactly the same we share a lot of dna with rats actually yeah it's we very share a lot of dna with a lot of different fucking tests <laughs> yeah so fuck um but yeah the guy that the guy that parker is talking about actually so like this guy's ridiculous he uh he actually has a cd wu-tang clan album that like nobody else has heard Nobody has. Oh, I've nothing. you've heard you said this before on the podcast. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's it's nine thousand hours. He's talking about. That's the guy that he's talking about. Nine thousand hours. You're you're it bothered you that much to where you had to. No, I just I it just no, it literally just came to me like I was like oh that's why it was it was so much it was because it was converting twelve thousand games into forty five minutes so I was like just divide it by six. I stupid. Yeah, I was trying to tell you guys that, and you guys were making it too complicated. Yeah, so yeah, it's, it, and I already came to that number before because I was like, "Oh, it's thirty divided by two, or a half of that." I just, so I just said nine thousand. I just said six thousand because I figured it would be half. Because I don't think a league game averages forty minutes. I think it would be more like thirty. Yeah, it's it's about thirty. It's it's like uh, the average game. All right, let's split the, the difference on thirty-five. All right, fuck all you. Okay? 35, yeah, thirty-five. It's about it's about seven thousand hours. Wow. Actually, it's thirty-seven Should point five. Let's just shit on ego. Now you don't know how to do math. It's thirty-seven point yeah. five. <sighs> So, uh, other big news. XXX Tentation. Never listened to him. Dead. Never even really knew who he was. Uh... <laughs> 3D goes 35 years. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 35 years in the league. I'm actually 72. <laughs> you just uh, reverse yes, age. XXX Tentation, dude. Dead. So, dude, here's the craziest thing. So. First off, this guy actually has some really good, really like deep ass shit. Like it's, I know that it's actually, I know, I know personally that it has helped people before, like just listening to his music and like, <clears throat> but I stay away he, from these type of type of thing. Like, just, but like, you listen to Hobo opinion. Johnson. Oh, dude, I fucking love Hobo Johnson ever since you showed him to me. You're right. Oh, he's so good. Hey, okay. No, I'm, I, mean, I, know, I was saying, I was saying I stay away <laughs> from these type of like, uh, 
what's it called? Uh, no, no, no. These these ultimatums that we're about to have, where we're about to be like, yeah, he had great music, but and then we go and say something about him. I just, no, 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 no. I'm just. I was. I was gonna say that he has helped a lot of people, <clears throat> but like <laughs> his his past is pretty shitty too. It's really hard for like somebody who is a big music and like you know like because like the the, the music the musical part of me like the person that's like really big into like his music wants to be like you know rest in peace. What that's the fuck? Really I don't even hear. Day. I don't even hear but, about that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, dude, I can. I there's actually a lot more I, than just. Yes. Yeah, I I I heard a story. I don't know if it's. True. So this guy, so this guy basically like beat the shit out of his girlfriend like every other day. Like was like holding her head under water, like threatening to drown her. And he uh he like actually made uh he actually like took like a pitchfork. I, I heard about barbecue. that fucker. Yeah, like a barbecue pitchfork, dude. And then took like a grill scrub and like basically told this girl like you get to choose. Jesus, man. Ah, uh, dude. And like she like. I guess she, like, picked the pitchfork and, like, other than, like, the scrub, and I guess that she, like, passed out from him, like, even rubbing it on her, like, thigh. And, like, she just, like, pa- like passed out just from, like, like fucking just being scared. It's messed up. And, like, like one day she, uh, she, like, was hiding behind, like, one of the fridge doors and, like, just ran out the back and, like, called her ex-boyfriend, like, and picked her up and shit. Like, but, yeah, he, he, she's uh, blind in one eye from him, like, being out of her. He was Yo. facing... He was facing life in uh, prison. How much, how, like, how, how do you look, how do you, how does this guy even fucking, I don't understand. Yo, he was going to do a charity event, too, apparently. Yeah, how do you, he's got, how like, do, you just, do that? How do you just be on one side, you're like, hey, I'm going to run a charity Seems like event. too much but hypocritical also, information. I'm stick a grill fucking thing up my girlfriend's ass or whatever she would Yeah, he's, I'm gonna I mean. My girlfriend until she can't see in one eye. That's why that's why it's really hard for me to be like, you know, How like do you... I feel bad for this guy, but like then again, like I hate to say it, but like damn did he You know what I'm saying? Like I hate to say that because it's like so fucked up to say it, but like right. don't do shitty shit. Like don't do you shitty probably wouldn't shit. have people you probably wouldn't have people coming shit. Yeah, but, like, I mean I don't here's I don't even, here's I don't... even the crazier part to the story. Sorry, I just wanted to say get this out because this yeah. is actually pretty crazy. The guy who is the suspected killer of him is like has like a hit list basically. I guess Little Peep was on his hit list. I guess X was on his hit. List. Now I guess he's going after Takashi Six Nine, and then like Little Pump and like uh, I think uh, Trippy Red is on. like I guess he's like trying to like get rid of like and Little Zan. I guess he's trying to like kill all of like these like new school rappers that like just like Damn. are just dumb as fuck. Yeah, speaking of which, uh, have you ever... What, wait, time out. What, what did I just say that, like, sparked your, like, memory of something? Like, what I just said was pretty fucking... You were like, on this subject, like... <laughs> on the subject of people going down a list and assassinating. Right. I'm an assassinate. No. Um, yo, I, have you listened to... <laughs> have you listened to 6 Nines like, ever? <laughs> Bro. Dude, he loves six you nine. Ask, you can ask Marina. I love six. Dude, His music no. is fire. Yeah, I know. Dude, I man, know, I bro. So it's like someone His saying they like so little cool. pump. I just like lose bro. all faith in your taste in music. <laughs> Marina's yeah. giving me like the worst look because I'm like over here, like, dude, I love six nine. She's just like, yeah. Okay, okay. Hold on one second. Hold up. I, I made. Dude, put any song and I know it. All right, just give me a second. He always, I got, yeah, I I, I I've heard, I've heard or seen Nico say six nine makes bops so many times. Bops, bro, that dude makes bops. He's. A... I can't hear you, Mike. Yeah, he just went out. <laughs> you can't hear me. Nope. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. Just, yeah. Oh, you can. Just okay. Hold on. That's fun. <laughs> right, hold on. We should just let him go. <laughs> Hold on. Honestly, like Lil Pump, I, I, I've grown. Let's see, let's see, let's see if, let's see if it, I, I wonder if it goes through. Can you hear it? Nope. I think it, I think it maxes out your Discord. Yeah. Up here, can you hear this? On a regular, just like a dick on a back, on a regular. Yeah, I love this song, dude. Dead. 
Yo, what about this? Hold up. Hold uh, on, let's hold just on. let's just get off the topic of music. I don't even like talking about music. Yo, that I just like Lil so Pump. Bad, I have, bad, dude. I have grown to like Lil Pump. Um, a couple of his songs. Who is six and nine? Tweety, look him up. He makes. He pops. said the Rainbow Man. Oh, he <laughs> makes bops. Does not make bops. Oh. Makes the opposite of bops. He makes spobs. He makes he makes makes duds. Bops. He makes wops. <laughs> Yo, yeah, you cut is... out. You cut out now, Nico. <laughs> Dude, Discord this... doesn't approve. I love six Discord nine. doesn't approve. I fuck with six. That's a good song. That's a good song. That's it. Let your nuts drag. Explicit content warning. Squad, uh... it's so cringe, man. Cringe. Ooh. Dude. <laughs> Listen, there was like, listen, there was we, this video on Can we change from him, music? Like, there was a, right, hang on, can, there was a video of him on Twitter, dude. There were so many people at his concert, dude. So many people. Let your nuts drag, dude. Yeah. Let them keep talking their Ooh, shit. Ooh. Kids, guy, kids this guy see ghosts. Are people not freaking? Kids see ghosts is a great ass. But we'll get off the subject of music because. T- Eric is not, uh, he's not, not about it. it. This isn't grabbing him by the nose. Um, that's one thing I wanted to talk about. Let's talk about, let's talk about the, uh, stuff we see on Twitter and Twitch, Mike. Oh, boy. Like, well, like <laughs> the said, World oh, Cup? Boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. These, 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 uh, wannabe game, game clans and. I mean, okay, so we don't really have much pedigrees. So can't really yeah, that much, so everything that we say about this, take it, take it with a grain of salt, but I mean. This is true. I see. I see. Like, like that's your kind of true. So I mean, I like we're we're I'm like low key kind of joking, but I mean at the same time, it's like yo, all these. There's so many people that I actually have to. Meet. I have I have uh, I've been following a lot of people um, to like be integrating myself into the into game. The, the specific, a lot. Yeah, yeah. This it. And I see a lot of people who are like trying to become affiliate, or like even are affiliate. Some some of the people, and they just hashtag spam like crazy, and or like only talk about their stuff going live. Right. Uh, so it's so so see, like okay. you'll see stuff like. Uh, like hashtag supports to all streamers. Hashtag this. Hashtag this. Like and hashtag, they spam hashtag, like, like forty of them. It's four, and then it's just like a bunch of ads. And then they'll at me. Like they'll just randomly at me. Like I had some random dude at me today. I was like, "What are you doing, bro?" Oh yeah, I've had that happen to them. Dude, no. It's- okay, so uh, what was I just watching? Hard. What was I just watching? Hashtags. No. Um. It was like about like the affiliate thing. Like. Yeah. Everybody wants to be an affiliate. Let me just tell you now. from somebody who has signed the contract. Because because as soon as you get an affiliate, dude, okay, this is why. Because Ninja made Twitch Prime subs fucking... So now everybody wants to become an affiliate because that's when you get your sub button. And yeah, then all of a sudden you want like, to make that money, man. Oh, uh, bro, uh, go ahead and uh, hit me with that Twitch Prime sub. Just like, dude, fuck off. No, I'm not doing that. I signed my affiliate contract, and honestly, dude, I wish that I could go back because I feel like I just like locked myself to Twitch, and I don't even you know. Like, you, like I mean, I didn't, but like in a sense, I kind of did. Like, I can't stream to you. Like, you can stream to YouTube, just not at the same time. Right, and I wish that I could. Like, I wish I could hit multiple See, platforms. See, coming coming from someone coming from someone that has done it, I'm not doing it anymore because I signed my affiliate contract today and did my emotes and everything. That is the announcement oh, I was going to talk about. Too. Yes, I did. Oh yeah. Coming dude, coming from go. my perspective, it's not it's not as worth it as as I thought it was going to be. Um, Congrats, and, Eric. That's and huge, I, man. I feel like nice I'm job. losing out on because I've had my affiliate like option for like two or three months now, and I feel like I've been losing out mm-hmm. on like being able to build a, a community because like once someone subs to you, they're like, yo, like I fuck with you. You know what I mean? If someone just follows you, they kind of forget about you. But if they drop a their uh-huh. once a month Twitch Prime on you, then it's like you you start to get to grow a community. You drop your once a month subscription, Eric. That's so nice. I love you too, man. 
such a so nice that, that's kind of my little oh. spiel on it. I just, I just, just don't like the pull towards. I just don't Again, like how everybody is trying to get the sub button. That's the biggest everybody, thing. Yes, like, exactly. Well, just I like just... grow your channel. Like if you're if you're really dedicated to this, like if you're like you okay, be in it for the long term. I'm gonna right? go, just follow yeah, for follow, I'm, bro. I'm gonna be oh, okay. I'm gonna be like gone, I'm gonna go on a little bit of like a tangent really quick because like I know we've discussed with this before, but like dude, YouTube, Twitch, like you know anything video game video related, like been something that I've 100 locked in on since like I was so like. You know, this, like, this type of stuff, like, and I, I feel like I speak for everybody here when I say this, but, like, this stuff, like, we're not in, the, for, like, the money, basically. We're in this to, like, genuinely connect with people, like, actually talk and actually, like, have conversation. So, like, when I, like, when I see people out there that you can thirsty, and yeah. it's, it's, like, it's almost like a slap in my face because I'm part of that stream. Oh, that's and how everybody like, on the streamer community feels, dude. They, they can smell that shit in my I yeah, can see it's all just over like, Twitter. and it's just like, dude, all you're you're not connecting with your you're not connecting with your followers. You're not like reaching out. It's all numbers like, to have, them. You don't yeah, have a, they, you don't have a like, Discord channel. Like you don't have any way of people. Get, dude, you do you, do you even Discord? Do you even Discord, bro? But like, it is like it is like a huge way to get your community going. I mean, we have like a pretty good community growing right now just from our Discord, and like yeah, you know, it's, it's awesome. awesome. And it's, yeah, and it's really awesome like to see. Like you know, today I saw somebody come in and say, "Hey, who wants to play some Fortnite today?" When I saw that dude, it was like oh, really? awesome. Yeah, like I was like, this is amazing. I have somebody like actually looking for somebody in our community to like play with and to like actually like connect with. That made me feel so good. Like I felt like I was dude, that's creating awesome. an outlet for somebody to like read basically. Dude, that was that was actually what the blog post I wrote about. Um mm -hmm. I actually didn't talk about this ever on on one of the on any of the podcasts that we've done, but like yeah, I wrote a blog post for our website, uh, the first one that I did like about like three or four weeks ago. Well, and, you deleted like, an idiot. No, I, I like accidentally. Like what happened was I wrote it inside of the code HTML instead of yeah, instead of typing it out first and then formatting it and then putting it into the putting it into the website. Right. So like when it came out, um, I, I accidentally closed out of it or something, and it didn't. So it closed out the entire thing. But anyways, I've been I the blog post was about how T started um the origin like how I met uh all you guys and like basically what I was doing beforehand. Um and that was that was one of the reasons why I really, really like this channel and like why I really, really like this our Discord is because I before I met you guys, it was I had no one to play with. I had yeah, I was no, sitting I was sitting at my I was yeah. sitting at my computer and I would just meet these guys like one offs. They would be like, they wouldn't feel like I was hanging out with anybody that like really cared about whether or not I was playing right. with them. And right. that, that like, and I also wasn't hanging out with my friends as well. all my friends were away. And it was the, what I, I don't want anybody else to ever feel again is like the crippling, like feeling of just being alone, like at my game, like at the end of it, like if I would rage for rage at a game and just be sitting at my computer, just completely alone, pissed. not being able to play with anyone, right. just it's depressing and just friendless and just by myself, like not being able to talk to anyone. Like, I don't want anybody ever to feel like that, like ever again when they're like, that's what I really love about this channel. That Like we're taking, we're taking people that like, maybe, maybe they're not part of another discord community or maybe they don't know how to like become like a Twitch streamer and they want to, or maybe they want to play games, <clears> want to stream. Like they don't know how, or like maybe they don't have any friends and they're all alone to like play games. With them. Just want like something to talk to on it. I I love that like this community, not even our community, but also the Twitch community. Like if you're part of another Discord, I, some sometimes with the bigger ones. But I love that ours like gets to be like I get to talk to Tweety if like if Tweety wants to talk to me, he can yeah. get, uh like on Twitter or he can get up in the Discord. If he wants to play a game, I can go. Mm -hmm. I played a game with him actually the other day inside of his on his stream. It's actually pretty fun. Mm -hmm. I suck ass at. So does Tweety. So does Tweety. Tweety. Throwing shade. Um, Email five. <laughs> yeah, you know Tweety, like, uh, you know, like that's really good that you follow your like everybody that you follow your friends with and watch your watch their streams. Like that's awesome, dude. Like, yeah, that's what I've been doing. I've been actually like, going into the stream. Right, like, but the majority of people, like the majority of people on Twitch, don't do that. The majority of people. Ninety nine percent of them don't do that. Right. Yeah. A lot of their a lot of the people in our like I shouldn't say. I should say in our community because it's like the Twitch community, they really just don't care. Kind of like 
you know, they're looking for. I think the partners for... care a lot more, but that's that's because they've worked hard in it. Like you know, you can tell that right. those the people that are successful on Twitch are are the people that care. And it, you can tell. right, like no, it, for, for the most part, I feel like that's what makes I feel like that's what makes us us different because like I see all of these like just like these clans and and teams that are like on our level like followers and numbers wise but i mm-hmm. i don't like i got a, not an argument but i got into like a little conversation with this this team leader of this team like some and they were talking about like how can we do better and i was like you guys need like i don't know what you look like i don't know your name Wait, i don't know anything what? about you when did that happen um a few days ago they're like they how can we do better no, no no he didn't message me directly well they did message me directly and asked me i've i've been asked like four times to be part of like these content teams and I'm like, I'm committed to something else. But either way, I got into this conversation where they were, he was like, he put out a tweet and he was like, you know, how can we get better? I was like, be a human, like connect with people. Don't just be like a, a faceless logo where, yeah. where you just don't, where you don't interact with people. Like you, like we interact with people and like don't, yeah, on our Twitters, not, yeah. like I mean, your Twitters, Mike, um, like I said this and you weren't here. I said this earlier. I was like, I feel like we put out equally as much content as like, huge streamers like i feel like our twitters are doing like the most that we can like as far as well, connecting yeah, I mean, with people and, and engaging people all the time i mean i'm on that i'm on twitter or seven so i mean if uh if anybody here is watching um that doesn't follow our twitter or like wants to like hit us up or anything hit us up on that twitter because I, if you need to contact me if for anything like hey man like what's this about or like hey i have a question about this or like i like anything about like gaming or computers or anything like that you can hit me up because like i'm there looking at every tweet that comes in like almost 24 7 when i get home a little bit different because like i i like try to decompress a little bit from reading so much crap all day on twitter <laughs> like i have to sift through so much stuff so many all hashtags day. like dude it's it's not even funny like yeah like i i, I tweeted you're, you're not you're you're not, are you saying like you're doing that? Yeah, he says I make sure to say hello every morning on Discord. I join. Oh, in his Discord. Okay, I thought he was saying that. I was gonna say like, do you? Uh, yeah, no. I mean, um, I meant about the hashtags and stuff. Um, I mean, hashtags are good if they're targeted. Um, but spam uses but spam spam hashtags that just look like somebody's copied and pasted. Like a um, PSA, don't do that. Uh, <laughs> another PSA, another PSA, don't at all these freaking that are like follow for follow quickest they're retweets not, they're not those all right, those accounts aren't trying to help you or get people to like actually care about you enough to like retweet go on here's what you got to do i'm gonna i'm gonna straight up <clears throat> i'm gonna straight up tell you this you guys right now go on twitter look at whatever game you go go to like the search bar search say you play fortnite search Fortnite. that's what i do what people are tweeting about in the morning go there and just interact with them get another human being like hey man like Check out their stream. Go to their stream and be like, "Hey, man, like, what's up?" Like, try to be a friend to them. Yeah. Don't treat them. They're another. Those people that you're looking at are another person on the other. Like that. That's another person on their account. And even the smaller streamers, those those people are looking for people to talk to too. Right. Go there and talk to those people. Don't just expect people to look at your content just because you're putting out something. You know right. what I mean, if you want people to that are re- like really there for your type of content be really truly there for them you have to it's it's empathy like you give and you take you know what i mean like you're not you're not just looking not just putting out random hashtags and random ads and all these follow for follow accounts that don't really even care whether or not like you tweet you go live they just want you to at them so that way other people can like they they get other monetization from you do right it's not helping you and if anything it's it's putting in my you, eyes it's hurting you it's hurting you yeah, i'll, I'll just mute that because other people uh, yeah i mute i mute people like crazy if i see that if i see that i'm just like just con- if i see it once i'll be like okay maybe they're just doing but if i see it like multiple times a day or like looking at people like hey can i i'm trying to get 50 followers can you come in and give me like this amount of followers please and there's like 40 minutes don't even gonna have a cam like work on yourself internally on your stream like try to get your stream like where it's quality where organic growth want. where people want to be there like i i'm actually like for a little while there i was struggling but like i started my like i was playing fortnite i've been playing fortnite mainly i started off my stream the other day with like five or six people that like j- like literally just wanted to like sit there and watch with me like play fortnite Wait, i was like whoa, that's bro. cool 
You play Fortnite? No, I'm saying, oh. like, instead of... Your camera's messing up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Yo, you're back. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Technical oh difficulties. Of course, that just comes. No, out. it's the new. It's the new Sony Vegas effect. Like our transitions. Uh, transition. I don't know what the fuck that. Was, bro. Dude, you that was your camera. Like um. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, I love this. Uh, but uh, have any? Have you guys been watching the? Huh? No, absolutely not. Right. The so only thing I'm... that I saw. The only thing I saw. No, no, no. Just onto the next subject. We're gone. Yeah, we're, we're, we're done. Subject. Mike, you'll just you'll just ramble. Let's go. I tried to talk about. I wanted to talk about how. Well, you're about you're about, about to right roast now. me. You're about to roast me for misunderstanding what I was trying to say about Fortnite. Continue. I don't know anything about that. But He's like, yeah. you play Fortnite? <laughs> All right, so uh, we're off this uh, podcast. I'll see you guys later. Nobody <laughs> wants to talk about the damn World Cup. Fuck. Wait, if you want to talk about the World Cup, go ahead and talk. Go ahead and talk about it. I You're going to be talking to I yourself. Think, I just think it's crazy, dude, that Russia is coming out. Like how they... Nobody expected Russia to basically like perform as well as they are. They're actually on their way. Like the round of 16, and it's pretty, pretty fucking... That's all I wanted to say. Please said something about Argentina. Argentina? Ooh. Did Argentina blow up? Argentina has Leonel. Oh, do they? Who's that? Just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Whoa. I'll Whoa. fight all of you. Whoa. Um, all I saw is that, like, we're freaking out about uh, Cristiano Ronaldo's, like, hat trick. Barcelona. Wait, no. It was against, um... Golasso! Portugal. Portugal. Wait, was it? Or Spain? What did you say? I didn't hear Spain what you said. Portugal? Was it Spain? Cristiano Spain? Ronaldo scored a hat trick, is what Mike said. Mm, well, it had to been something with Portugal because that's where Cristiano Ronaldo plays. Yeah, I know. I think uh, they're playing Spain. Let's see. Can't I can't believe Mexico beat Germany. Right that's crazy. Dude, this he is yeah. Portuguese against Spain. Yeah, it was against Spain. He tweet- okay. uh, see, freaking uh, Parker's been watching the world. Yeah, Something because that Parker is Parker used to play soccer when he was uh, young. Oh, Check did he play really with Aaron? Time. Yeah, he played yeah, with Aaron. Yeah, nice. He's been he's been playing for or he's been playing and watching for a really long time. He he's actually the one that got me like soccer. I dude that oh dude I wish we got a video. Uh, no, we don't. Yeah. Nico has like a yeah. short clip of it. That's it. Really. Oh, dude, that was so much fun. I want to do that again. I yeah, love it was soccer. A good time. I used to play pickup soccer a lot. Pretty good. Now we're, now we're just kind of reaching, though. What? We're just kind of reaching. What do you mean? Um, I was talking about pickup pick soccer on our live podcast. Um, you know what was uh, freaking hilarious? The of our country has created the Space Force. Space. Yeah, they just basically just uh, told everyone. No, which is awesome. No, yes, they, they yes, didn't. They did. yes, Jesus, they did. dude. No, they didn't. Yes, they how, do did. how do you figure? How do you figure? That's how I figure because figure? he said he said I want the United States to be the, like the biggest force in space. Yeah, so we're getting a head start dude, on every other country. Aliens. He's talking about, he's talking dude, about the he's other talking superpowers. About he's talking no. about, like, Russia, like, China. No, he's talking about aliens. No, there's aliens out there, and I oh think we're going to finally start to, like, in- Yeah, okay. Awesome. Yeah, okay. For- All right, podcast he's, is over, guys. About- Have a great night. Just kidding. Yeah, okay, well, we I mean, can talk about this if you want. We can talk about this if you want. Aliens are real. How do you figure? How do I figure? Because you don't math- know. it's mathematically impossible for us to be the only thing. Actually, it's not honestly, mathematically impossible. Yes, it, it's yes, just it is. It's, it's mathematically impossible. Yeah, but there, it's, it's also mathematically there. impossible that they would exist at the same exact time as us, as us and know where we are. And, no, it's not. Yeah, it is. The I universe is freaking massive, man. Okay, but like... Eric, you're you're making mean, a lot of jumps when you're assuming that... like. Not really. Uh, this... this 
species X is as intelligent as us. See, I want to believe in aliens just as much as you do, but I'm just thinking realistically. You know how long here. Would... They got to be as intelligent as us at least. They also have to know where we are. They have to know how to get to where we are, and they have to be lucky to be close enough or be able to live in the right environment. I know, but now you're starting to think that, like, now you're starting to think that, like, oh, we are this all massive. No, I'm not saying that at all. I'm not. There, we're it's, it's just not saying that at all. There can definitely be things that are more intelligent. There's no way to prove not, it until we can. Dude, I didn't. I didn't. I don't know where you got that from at all. I said they would at least have to be as intelligent as us to be anywhere okay, near yeah, space like, travel. I mean, like, like, like Tweety said, no, no, they wouldn't even be able to space travel to us. Do you know how long the you have seen like galaxy is? I know, but like, okay, but we have billions of light years. Yeah, and we're starting to and we're starting to just look into black holes and seeing how black holes can actually jump through space and actually could... black holes cannot can are not are not wormholes. Black holes I know. are not wormholes. I know, I understand that, but black holes can they have they're looking into it right now. They're researching it to see if black holes can actually convert to time because time because time is real in like I want to say it's like the third third or fourth dimension. Okay. Our certain type of time is not real, but time and space is real. So there is ways to take to basically crunch space to be able to get across it quicker. There, there is like there has to be time. It universe is able to be manipulated. The universe is able to like it's an infinite amount of space. It can be distorted to basically be able to. Like, <laughs> Did you see a tweet? Wait, just, no, my chat isn't working. I can't see. He says, "I like Dark Knight's teddy bears behind him. They're it's so cute." Oh, uh, yeah. They're my fiancés. I got it for her. Um, um, yo, so here's, here's my it is, thing. It is mathematically impossible for there to not be life on another probable. Yeah, but you you say that, and I, I would agree with you, but you can't ignore the fact that it's also mathematically very fucking improbable that those people would know where we are and be able to find us. You can't, I mean, you can't say one and ha not say the other. I mean, not really, because here's the thing is, is like, we're pretty intelligent, but we're pretty fucking stupid, too. It's all relative, though. They could be cavemen, or they could be fucking... I mean, absolutely, but I just don't think that, like, there uh, there has to be a species out there that is more intelligent than we are. All right, if there are, I guarantee it. But oh, there's, there's, you gotta think of this, there's, there's, there's also, like, the time thing, like, there are millions and billions so and billions of years. If, no, I'm, I'm saying, like, for, the, for them to be here at the same exact time as us is very improbable not really so like okay so if you look into if you look into like why like some people believe that life was actually created through at the deepest parts of the earth there's events that actually where the food chain air. starts <clears throat> yeah like but there is this uh there's this event that shoots out like uh, bacteria basically like they've actually and it can actually support life there's actually life down at the deep parts of the ocean and they can they can see that bacteria the bacteria that is being produced by these vents can actually be like can actually evolve into something. They're just waiting to see what it does because evolution obviously takes a long. Time. Right. They found these same vents on Mars. They found these same vents on Venus. I'm pretty sure they found these vents on different planets. So like for us to believe that there is like no life on other planets is pretty. I don't want to say stupid. Well, I guarantee you, there's bacteria on other planets. There's yeah, there's there has like to less be. intelligent. Right. There's, so if there's bacteria, then it can evolve. I mean, I'm definitely think, but like, here's the thing: is, is we might also, we might be worst we, evolved species. I mean, but there could have also been there could have also been species that have evolved before us. We could have evolved. We could have evolved on Mars and then <clears> went Mar when Mars when Mars it went extinct. We moved Earth. Million years, yeah, but there there's there could be people that are millions of years ahead of us. Dude. I mean, of course. I mean, the the probabilities of anything are endless. Like, yeah. I could say, like, I could say Cthulhu, the god, you know, fuck the cow, and that's how we got here. There's no way to prove that it's wrong. It's, it's idiotic. That's what, saying, that's what we're saying, like, though. Is there's no I way know, to prove like, that there is actual. But there, there is it, a possibility. A like, direct, a direct, like yes or no question. No, like there is no like way to prove. But when you incorporate science and math into it, I mean. Yeah, it's highly it's probable that there's there's out there that that is as intelligent or or like vastly more intelligent than. Me. But there's no way that there's no way we'll almost ever be able to tell until we get at least able to observe Dude, other government, galaxies. Our, our government knows. We about can't it. even. We can't even. We can't even observe. 
can't even well i think we've observed have we observed like most of the known like <laughs> he said i wrote my senior research paper on ancient aliens basically 12 page pages of there is no conclusive evidence but it would be kind of cool <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's true it's exactly. you can't you can't there's not really you're not really able to argue it's all theory and i mean the, the, pyra pyra the pyramids is a pretty good example there's a, there's a theory there's a theory that we were once escaped to earth what i just said earlier yeah i'm i'm more i'm more inclined to believe that when it comes to the pyramids thing i'm more likely to believe that we were more advanced in history than we think we were rather than i would believe yeah. in aliens i love the library Dude. yeah i love the i love the that that library but even if they were more intelligent than we think that they are even us we cannot we we cannot no. Yo, there's how no possible way. way. There's no how? possible way that even in our time we could make perfectly square blocks and pick them up. Those things are so heavy, dude. How, how, how scatterbrained like, are we? That we and you're we, just telling me that this dude is pyramids. just like <laughs> this dude's just like pull, and these guys are just like, Ooh, like lifting up blocks. Like you're no, come on now. How did no. that go again, dude? These guys are straight <laughs> whipping these guys like. <laughs> Let's take the block and move it over here. Yeah, my theory, no, my theory was that they built it. They they crafted the block. In okay, come on, right. Mike. <laughs> uh, this is the end of the podcast. It was great chatting with you guys. <laughs> Get me off this topic. How are we this scatterbrained that we've gone? From <laughs> well, we talked about well, we talked about space. We, thought, we were talking about Twitter. We talked about space flow. Now you act talking. like this is dude, like I, you act like this dude, isn't no, like because, a regular thing that we, like, dude. We no, do every single dude. I think I think it's every single podcast. I think every single podcast we're like, oh yeah, that's great, cool, cool, uh, cool Twitch stream that you got going on there. Have you heard about the fucking pyramids? We this yeah. is only the second time we've talked about pyramids on the podcast. I, I have all of, I have all of the I have I think all we talked of our about podcasts. it last week. I have all the auto audios too. I have all the and videos. Three out of I'm like what sixteen. Sure. This is the 16th? I thought this was the 15th. I don't know. I'm I pretty guess. sure it's the 15th. 15th. Who do you use five episodes? That's how the I blocks were definitely more than two tons on average. At 50 meters high, already 82% of the an average density of use the large limestone blocks weighted 6.5 to 10 tons, and the smaller ones are about 1.3. Twitter to alien. Seriously, perfectly summed up. That should be like the title of our freaking podcast. Yo, I have a question for Bob, or obviously Parker and Tweety. Um, should, in addition to the ten minute highlight that I did of like the because the Tweety podcast, I did like a highlight so you guys could watch it and not have to sit through the whole thing if you choose not to. Should I also upload the full one alongside it? I don't think well, it should go. On... <laughs> I mean, yeah, I don't think it should go on YouTube. I mean, you see a lot of, until, until we have a lot of people watching this and we can pre-record it so and then upload the it on minutes. Tuesday. I think the 10 minute because, okay. I mean, just fair. I'm, just, I'm asking, it, I'm, I'm asking. It incites people to actually come and watch this live. It's true. And then they can also watch the VOD on Twitch. Just, it just brings people to our content and we, and we don't want to give like an easy escape. Uh, just watch the because then we might as well not even do this. Parker. The source on this was www.cheops pyramid. C the website. <laughs> I just I can't wait till I, we get to do these at the live, like in person. Those are, oh, I want to be able to. Yeah. I want to be able to control That's, every level of audio dude, and video. Yo, and it's lighting. gonna be so sick when we actually have it. When we have it like live with good lighting, good camera, like all in one section, dude. Oh, bro, we can switch to our faces like H three, dude. Yep. Get real cameras. I already have the mics. I already have all that set up. That's gonna be sick, dude. I hope. I hope you guys that actually come in here, like we really appreciate you guys spit, spit like bullshit for like an hour right now because. Obviously, this wasn't the podcast we had highly planned. In fact, plan you know, B. Like, if we're being completely honest with you guys, we had to run 
uh, we had to write, we were going to do this if he didn't show up, but then we scrapped this outline because he didn't show up on our Discord. And then we had to rewrite this outline, and it wasn't even an outline. It, it, like, we had five minutes to go until nine. This guy's not here. Yeah, but it was still, and it, we had to outline. It was still, we still touched on a lot of interesting things. Oh, no, no, no. Was... Yeah, no, because we're good at, we're good at this at this live and on the fly and like having like a small outline but i mean the, we do this uh, yeah i've been doing this with my friends for years so it's not anything. but the point that i wanted to make is that I, like i am really appreciative actually being thing and i hope that you guys are really excited for like the future of like what we have planned we have some crazy shit for the future shit. everybody hates nobody gives yeah. a shit I'm ugly. I'm a tomato. I'm just a tomato. I, I, I don't even care if no. I don't care if we have six people watching us. I honestly love podcasts and just sitting here with you guys and talking for like an hour is just so fun. It's like my like one of the highlights of my week <laughs> by far. It it's is fun. the highlight. of You my always week. get really nervous and anxious, but it's always really oh, I fun. get I get super nervous every time. I'm, I'm I, I freak we out. We gotta do this. We gotta do this. We gotta. I'm just like, bro. I yeah, got because this. Because I'm afraid we're gonna. I'm gonna forget. I'm afraid we're gonna get on here, dude. Just gonna be. We're, it's gonna be at 16 or something, and we're just gonna be like. No, oh, it's uh, never like that. We're we're, uh, we're we are dude, natural are we ever like that? Even in like. This dude, is, I that's know. What I'm saying this is like a regular thing. We'll be like, oh yeah, dude. I'm um, so did you see this? Oh hey, bro. What do you think about aliens? Not even on podcast. Yeah. Like we like this is just a normal thing. That's why I like doing these. Still, it, like it's not even a podcast. Really, like, more like. Us. Yeah, it's more of just like a hangout. Like we get to hang out with live, talk about things that we're really interested. In. Like kind of a structure. Why I don't like calling bit. it a podcast. It's not. Yeah, it's not really much of a podcast. It, it was a podcast originally. Now it's like just hey, you guys want to come and chill with us? But we still like have the option of better. like interviewing people and making There's it serious. What's going on in here? Or or directing <laughs> it at like one specific. Like we could we could have dedicated a whole entire like episode Why towards like content. Oh, I know. I know love for Sasquatch. That's what I said. Sasquatch needs love. That's what I said. Sasquatch. You can't. No one can see it. It's cut off. <laughs> All right, guys. So I guess that, I guess that'll do it. We're literally at the sixty-minute mark. Um, like like Mike said, Parker and Tweety really appreciate you guys for coming in. Um, dope that you guys come in here every week. We're just this this week was kind of messed up because. Somebody bailed on us, but it's whatever. Yeah, I mean that's gonna happen. Uh, but yeah, I mean we're gonna we're gonna try every week to. Eventually, we're hoping that it gets to the point where people are want to basically begging to get on here. Yeah, begging, bro, sucking our toes begging to do on it on their knees, licking our toes, get on here. So we're hoping, dude. I love Oblivion Park. That 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 was one of the games I was gonna talk about that I was addicted to. I had. So many hours in that game. That was like one of my favorite. Like, games you want to talk about scatterbrain? You're the scatterbrain. Yeah, yeah I am the scatter. I'm a huge scatterbrain. But anyways, yeah, I, I just, I just, I just want you guys to know that like we're, we're gonna make this like as best as we can forward all the time and better. Like as you guys are here, you know that you've been here. Those of you that've been yeah. here from like episode one, <laughs> you've been here from episode one, bro. Dude, Holy Parker's actually been shit. here. From, Parker and Sweetie have been here from lowest episode. Episode one was so bad. They fuck off. Oh, cool. <laughs> it was so bad. Yeah, episode one was actually so. Actually, it was oh, so dude. ugly, bro. Um, dude, it was. It looks so ugly and freaking. Oh, if we go back to that, that's crazy. I can't wait till we get like hundredth episode. We got to go back to episode one. Yeah, when should happen. we start season two? Twenty episodes. Oh yeah, yeah. We're start. Oh, by the way, guys. Yeah. So if you didn't know, we're starting season two at twenty episodes. Um, which, what we're gonna do is, I, I think the best plan is probably we're gonna for about like two. Weeks. Um, and then restart like an entire like new season of the podcast live, and then see if we can revamp it, um, get some stuff together, and like probably get a promotional video out uh, on YouTube like the week before it goes out. Um, Parker said be, the first gonna... episode was about conspiracy theories, wasn't it? <laughs> That's why I got offensive about it. Yo, dude, we talked about we talked about a sex robot. Oh, oh yeah, that's what it was. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we talked about the sex robot. I remember that. Oh. Let's not get back on that I'm conversation. Gonna, yeah, we're not gonna get I into it. We already know your opinion. We already know your opinion. We don't want to talk about it anymore. All right, guys. That's gonna do it. Everybody, shut up. That's gonna do it for today. We're not gonna talk about the sex robot. We're not gonna talk about anything else. <laughs> we'll be back next week. We'll be back next week, hopefully with an interview. Okay. Yeah, we'll be back next week. Peace. Would guys. you? Love you guys.